Hello Edmonton! My name is Joanne and I'm here to tell you all about raising hens in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. In this video, we'll be talking about chicken house design. Shelter serves two purposes protection from predators, and protection from environmental conditions. For environmental conditions, during the summer months, chickens are more likely to suffer from heat stress. In the winter months, chickens are more likely to suffer from illness derived from excess moisture, increase in ammonia and carbon dioxide levels, and freezing conditions. Before I go on, let's talk terminology. A coop is a hen house. A run is an enclosed area that's attached to the coop to allow chickens to roam around. A nest box is a box in the coop where chickens lay eggs. And a roost or a perch is a long pole for chickens to rest on at night. Now when you're building your coop, you want to make sure that you position it in a way that reduces wind exposure. Another thing you can do is position your windows to face south to catch more of that light during the winter months. If you're planning on raising laying hens, you want to make sure that you provide artificial lighting for at least 14 to 16 hours of light per day. And the fourth thing you should do is make sure that you have a sturdy roof to withstand all of that Edmonton winter snow. Some common materials that you might want to use are polyurethane spray foam insulation, reflective insulation, glass wool insulation, or fiberglass insulation. Make sure to include a vapor barrier so that your insulation material does not become moist or wet. Also, chickens will eat anything, so make sure that your insulation material is properly covered and hidden. You can build a run or a fence. Just make sure that it is protected from all the predators outside and it doesn't let your birds escape. Now we'll talk about coop necessities. Hens love to perch on roosts that are raised, but be careful not to raise them more than three feet off the ground or else it can cause problems like leg injuries. Be sure to place your roosts higher than your nest boxes because chickens will always try to find the highest place to perch. The other thing is nest boxes. So provide one nest box for every three to four hens. Hens prefer nesting boxes that are private, not crowded, and comfortably bedded. They will lay eggs in nest boxes that are shaded or in the darker parts of the coop. You can use wood shavings or chopped straw for comfortable bedding, but avoid things like cedar wood shavings or shredded newspaper. Another important thing you need to pay attention to is floor litter. Chickens need a dry environment, so make sure you provide 2-5 to five inches of absorbent litter material such as wood shavings, straw, or chips to reduce moisture content. Finally, make sure you provide a dust bath. Dust bathing is a very common behavior seen in chickens. They love to roll around in loose materials such as sand, dirt, and mulch. This helps clean their feathers and remove parasites. That's it for today. I hope you enjoyed watching and learned a thing or two about hen keeping in Edmonton. If you're interested in what a coop floor plan design would look like, I've attached a sample created by Alberta Farm Animal Care. You know, Alberta Farm Animal Care, or AFAC, is a multi-species livestock welfare organization. They post a great ton of stuff on their website, and they have a really great way of explaining concepts pertaining to farmers and agriculture. Feel free to check out their social media or their website at afac.ab.ca. Thanks everyone.